Some players are guys who, they're players in life. You're the real deal. Um, he's a real player. He's a go-to person. And so that's another way. Of, I could go to that. or He could go to the players' Not wall. And they, yes, you could. You're a real <laughs> player in the television industry. That's right. <laughs> Tells it like it is, doesn't he? It's the new season of Judge Mathis. It started yesterday right here on KCAL 9. The 20th season for the courtroom show. We're excited to have Judge Greg Mathis here with us today. And we so much to congratulate you on. I mean, this is, this is a big milestone, right? Yes, 20, it is. 20 years in television? Yes, and thank you. And thank congratulations you. on the Emmy Award. Yeah, thank you. All due to great viewers who have stuck with me for 20 years. And I appreciate them much. I, I know that the show has uh, changed over the years. And you've been focusing a lot lately on helping people. Talking mm -hmm. about the, the opioid epidemic in this country. Yeah. You know, uh, I built my career on public service. And so when I came to television, I did a lot of public service yeah, off the that. show. Mm -hmm. But I felt... Uh, with a couple of million viewers, we could do more to uh, show change in the lives and inspire the lives of others. So now we have went into another phase outside of the inspiration and me giving tough love. We're giving direct services now. Mm -hmm. And when you help these people, do you, you often send them off to rehab? Yes. Do you and hear? we pay for it. And you pay <laughs> for it. The show pays for it. That's one of the things we were very fulfilled by with one of Brother Telepitcher's uh, productions. Do you ever hear back from them? All uh, the time. Uh, so you're changing lives. Yep, we are. And that brings me perhaps the most fulfillment about the show these days. Yeah, it's a lot more than a yeah. TV show when you, when you find your calling and you can make an impact like that. Yeah, you know, with the opioid epidemic, we're able to, we have parents who bring their children there for judge help change them. Some volunteer and do go into rehab and some do not and some fail and some win but I think we're batting about uh, 70 mm -hmm. and 75 or so and if that's you look at baseball that's a major all-star <laughs> <laughs> an Emmy and an all-star yeah and um, you've been doing a lot with DNA testing as mm -hmm. well it's so yes. interesting yeah and the purpose of that is uh, one to help the um, parents or would-be parents it costs mm -hmm. about a thousand dollars for uh, accurate one. Um, Drugstore sometimes accurate and not so sometimes. And so we pay for counseling as well in mm -hmm. addition to the testing. And those parents who we feel need counseling, we pay for that and send them there when sometimes they discover things that are uh, traumatizing. So I was watching the uh, Aretha Franklin mm -hmm. memorial service last yeah. week and uh, you spoke. Didn't know that you were friends, but the, the New York Times called your oh, eulogy no, no, no one of the most memorable. Really? They really did, yeah. It's oh. in the New York Times. So, oh, how humbling uh, is that? This, this friendship with Aretha, it was something that mm -hmm. was very special to you. Yeah, it began in the 80s, uh, working uh, in the community, and I was introduced to her working in the community for the mayor of of Detroit at that time and then when I came to a public light she wanted to make sure that I was using my platform the same way she used hers mm -hmm. coming up and that's in advancing the cause of social justice and uh, she encouraged me a lot and called me uh, about monthly to make sure that I was doing it. <laughs> Greg get out there on the front line they got problems in Flint they have problems here so uh, she was really encouraged me to use uh, my public life in a positive way to change mm -hmm. lives. Yeah, and you made that promise to her, and it yep. certainly. I we told her I would. Last time we spoke, she, we were talking about the Flint water crisis, which hasn't been addressed. In fact, there's been some retraction. And she said, you got to get up there and fight again. Mm -hmm. And I told her that's what I'm going to do. She used the term, sock it to him, sock it to him. She said, <laughs> Greg, go up there and sock it to him. All right, you've got a promise to keep. That's right. Congratulations on all your success. Thank you. And thanks for being Thank here, Thank you all Judge. for supporting me. Y'all yeah. couldn't have done it without KCAL, <laughs> number two market, I say number one in the world. <laughs> in our hearts, too. Thank, thank you, you Judge. Sandy. <laughs> All right, thanks. You can watch Judge Mathis weekdays at 2 o'clock right here on KCAL 9.